Hey YouTube fam, it's your girl Gladys here to inspire you to live out loud via hair, fashion, and lifestyle. And we're back with another video. Today is $20 Tuesday, and as y'all know, $20 Tuesday is a special time on my channel where I showcase super cute yet super affordable hair fashion styles for the $20 price range and below. Today's video is different, y'all. We're not doing wigs, and honestly, I haven't really been doing wigs like that so far in 2022. I've been somewhat on a little wig break outside of the U part wig i did the outre one which i really enjoyed <laughs> outside of that i have just been wearing my natural hair out i've also been wearing my headband wigs easy breezy beautiful right and now i've been venturing into the ponytails now ponytails is not something i've done often it's something i used to do when i was like in high school right and then i found wigs later on in my 20s and i kind of just stuck with that for a while i remember doing some model model ponytails i did a video on that but now I found these ponytails, these afro texture ponytails on Amazon and it's lit. I'm so excited to showcase these styles. I have three of them today. Two of them start within the $20 price range. The last one is a little bit higher. Either way, it's super affordable, especially because these are human hair ponytails, y'all. So I think you will really enjoy this video. Make sure you give me a like, save this video, share it with a friend who you care about because Y'all are gonna wanna know about this. And I actually showcased one of these ponytails in my Synthetic Ways You Slept On series. Thank y'all to those who've been supporting that series. Part two is coming out tomorrow, so make sure you tune in for that. But yeah, y'all, let's just get into it. The first ponytail I'm gonna show y'all is this Afro Texture Ponytail. It retails for $24.99 on Amazon. I already took this out the package earlier and looked at it, but this is what we have here, y'all. So look, you see, it's kinky. It's like giving me like a blown out type of vibe. I would say it's like a number two color because I definitely noticed like brown pieces throughout this. It's definitely dry though. Oh my God, it's so dry. But I just wanna plop this on and show it to y'all straight out the pack. Also, I do notice that here, the roots are straight all around. But I don't think it really matters for the style that I'm doing today, which is up top. And as you can see, my natural hair is just wrapped up in a tight top knot bun, nothing crazy. I use some Echo Styler gel, but not a lot. And as you can see, my hair is like not like super sleek right now. It's still looking very textured, which I'm totally fine with that look. However, if you're into laying your edges, slicking your edges down and having a more smooth, silky look and you want to use some edge control, I do have a link for that in my description box, the She Is Bomb Edge Control, which I recommend because it works extremely well for my type 4 hair. By the way, all the ponytails that you see will be linked down below. If for some reason you can't find it or navigate my description box, please leave me a comment and I'll help you out. Alright y'all, so this pony comes with this comb here in the front, this comb here in the back. This actually has three combs, okay, and a drawstring. And as you can see, I already pulled this drawstring very tight. So we're just gonna pop this bad boy on. Literally, just pop her on. <sighs> All right, I'm hooking this here. I'm attaching the back comb first and then the two front combs second. I'm just pushing it into my hair. I'm pulling the string tight here. Ooh, that's tight. I'm going to wrap this string around. Literally, I just tuck the string underneath the clip here. And then I just start fluffing this out. <laughs> Wait a minute. Yo. Is that it? Is that all I had to do? Like, I mean, I'm fluffing at this, but I'm really not doing much, y'all. Now the way this puff feels, it definitely feels softer at the root because the root is straighter. It's coarser towards the top and that feels a little bit dry, but you know what I would recommend? I recently tried this product thanks to my girls Kyra Sean and Brittany aka The Heart to Make 90. This is the Shea Moisture Coconut and Hibiscus Frizz Free Curl Mousse. It's made to moisturize and define thick, curly, kinky, curly hair. I would definitely apply some of this in this bad boy. Oh my god, because... It just feels a little bit dry, but this is what it looks like straight out the pack, y'all. What? <sighs> Look at this puff. You're telling me this is not my hair. Are you kidding me? I 
am floored right now. This looks so freaking natural. Look at the texture. Get that. Hold on. Hold on. I need y'all to see this texture. Hello, ponytail wear. This is me. <laughs> I'm so excited. Literally, I've worn my natural hair just like this. Literally, just like this. I will swoop it up, tie it up. Oh my God, look at it in the back. And you can see the string is not hanging out at all once you tuck it underneath. This looks amazing. And for my ladies who wear gray hair, can you imagine if they have this available in gray? I haven't found it yet. But you can always use like a spray to kind of like spray it gray, low key. That's a little hack. Maybe I'll link some silver spray um, in the comments because I've tried some before from Amazon. So yeah, but I am very impressed with this. $24.99 on Amazon, y'all. I mean, th this looks, uh, I'm loving this y'all. This is the six inch pony, but they do have this available in the eight inch and 10 inch length. So just imagine just even bigger than what I have here. But I know for me, this is like absolutely the length of my natural hair when I decide to wear a puff. So I just think it looks so realistic, but I wouldn't mind um, trying the 10 inch out and seeing how fluffy and big it looks. What do y'all think? Let me know in the comments. If you're watching this with me live in the premiere chat, let me know your thoughts. Yeah, this is a winner. For $25 and it's human hair, come on. If you just need to spruce it up, grab some of this Fritz Free Curl Mousse and get your life. I'm put some of this mousse in here. What does it look like when I do that? Ooh, ooh. <laughs> okay. It's definitely feeling softer. So this is what it looks like after I apply some of the curling mousse. And even though it's not looking any more defined, which I didn't expect it to because it came in this blowout style out the pack. And I kind of feel like it's meant to stay in this blowout style, even though it's human hair. But this is cheaper human hair. So let's manage our expectations. But it definitely feels softer. So. That is a plus. I definitely can't wait to try this when doing like a twist out on one of my ponytails. Maybe I'll do that in another video. If you wanna see that, let me know in the comments. I'm so glad that kind brought me putting on to this. All right, y'all, let's get into the next ponytail. Now this next one, y'all really loved it in one of my videos. This is from a different vendor and this is an Afro kinky ponytail. This is the 12 inches. So you can already see the difference, right? Compare, look. You see that this um, Afro Kinky one looks a little bit more defined in the curls, whereas this one kind of reminds me of like type 4 C, Z, E, F, G type hair, which is my type of hair, by the way. Now with this wig, this didn't look like this straight out the pack, y'all. I actually have teased this to the gods. Straight out the pack this is what it looks like. It's, it's very defined. And for a second I was like, oh, this turns into an Afro, but I knew it would because I saw the reviews. After plucking and prodding through this, I also used my curling mousse at the time when I first did it. It just looks more and more natural. Like, look up close. Look at that. Oh, God. This is absolutely gorgeous. But the ponytail construction is different on this one. This one only has two combs, one in the front, one the back and of course this adjustable drawstring here this is what the roots are looking like similar to the other one they it does start off pretty straight at the root but because i'm wearing this you know high up you're not going to notice any of that so literally y'all let me show y'all how easy this is let me let me just show y'all i'm just gonna pop this pony off doing this in real time right pop you see how i popped it off done and i'm just gonna pop this pony on this 12 inch one now this pony starts at 29.99 if you get the 10 inch but the 12 inch cost me 39.99 just so y'all are aware of the pricing so literally i just pop this joint clip it to the back i clip it to the front and look what we have here honey do you see how easy this is y'all who still sleep on these um, textured ponytails from Amazon? Cause I'm gonna need you to wake up. 
I need you to wake up right now. What? Are you kidding me? This ponytail is stunning. It's an absolute must have. I see why y'all were buying this up when I showed it the last time. I've been wearing this now for almost two weeks, like back to back, almost every damn day. Oh, let me wrap this around really quick. I just wrap it around and tuck it in. Come through. Oh, I'm sick. <laughs> Who's adding this one to the cart? Because it's that type of day. Who's on the website? Yes, Amazon, give me life. And this is one of those units that the older it gets, the better it looks. And the fact that it's human hair, I think it makes a difference. You can kind of tell that synthetic ponytails are synthetic because normally they have a higher luster which makes it look you know less real because my natural hair has a little luster and sometimes the curls are super defined which my natural hair is not but if you are a type 4 baddie like me honey do you see this literally took me less than 10 seconds to throw on my head and fluff out i don't think there's anything else left to say get the pony sis like it doesn't get any easier. This is why I haven't been wearing lace fronts lately because <laughs> I've been spoiled by this ponytail. Ah, oh, honey. And even C, she approves of it. She saw me and she was like, oh, you look really good. I can see your face. That's another thing. You can see all of me <laughs> when I have my hair up like this. So I'm with it, y'all. I hope y'all like it too. Let me know. I feel like this is one of those joints that can definitely sell out. So if you want it, I suggest you get it now. It is available in multiple lengths, anywhere from 10 inches to 22 inches. I do have the 20 inch one as well, but I have not messed with that one yet. But before I show you the 20 inch version, which will be the last ponytail I'll show you today, I do want to show y'all something that I just found as I was trying to pull up my links. And like, I'm like, damn, this would have been great for this video, but I'm still going to show it to y'all anyway. Okay, so this is an Afro Puff kinky, curly ponytail. It's a synthetic one. And the price is right, y'all. It's $12.99 for the 1B color, but you'll see other colors available for $9.99. I'm like, what? The red and a blonde color. So if you want an even cheaper price point, Maybe you don't want to spend the $30 to $50 for a ponytail like this, but you want an alternative. Try this ponytail out. From what I can tell, that short version is a 12 inch just like this one. I don't know, maybe I should buy it and do a comparison video where I compare a synthetic ponytail to a human hair ponytail. Is that something that would benefit y'all? Please let me know in the comments. If it will, I will do that for you. All right, y'all, last ponytail of the day is from the same company. This is the 12 inch, remember, right? So I'm gonna show y'all the 20 inch one. One thing I like is the packaging from this company. It's in a nice little cute purple baggie, has a label here that tells you the inches so that you can remember. And it does come with some type of, that's a headband. That is not cute. But this is what the hair looks like fresh out the bag, okay? Super defined type four hair and it has the same construction with the two combs of course because it's from the same company this is what i i was doing to it i was just kind of like fluffing it out like that i don't even want to comb through this i kind of just want to wear it just like this so you know what i'm gonna do first i want to see what it looks like atop my head and then i'll show y'all what it looks like with it um in a low pony okay so <laughs> Again, I have not played with this pony at all. I just had it sitting in the bag. So of course it's looking a little wayward, but with some fluffing, I can envision this looking super, super cute. But I want to wear this as a low pony. So let me go fix my hair. You could also put this in a nice bun too. Let me go fix my natural hair, put it in a low pony, I'll be back and show you what it looks like on. All right y'all, we are back with this ponytail. This is the 20 inches. Like I said, y'all already saw this one, which is the 12 inches, and this is over time. Like I've been wearing this for like two weeks. But this right here is pretty much fresh out the pack with me raking through the ponytail. I did spritz a little bit of water because the ends were going like all over the place. But there's no product in this. So this is what it's looking like over here. What do y'all think? I think this is super pretty. I'm obsessed. <laughs> I 
love it and i love the way it looks like from the front where you can see the hair from the front oh this looks so good now as far as the comb attachment right now i like pulled it as tight as i could and it feels secure way more secure than the first time i did it with the shorter ponytail but for my own peace of mind, I would still add bobby pins. And I'll actually link some from Amazon for your convenience. But yeah, y'all, I think these ponies, this is it. Now, if you are someone that suffers from hair loss, you know, around your edges, I would consider getting this 12-inch pony, wearing it atop your head like I had it earlier, and then just wrapping a pretty wrap around your hair like a scarf i've done that with quite a few of my headband wigs including this headband wig with the twist bun you can do that and your edges don't have to show now this particular pony is 69 dollars on amazon yes and this is human hair as far as the cons i would say main con is that there is a little bit of shedding but it's not a huge deal to me and also it's a bit dry but it doesn't feel any more dry than my natural hair when i don't properly moisturize it you know what i mean it's nothing like overly concerning i just know i can go with my shea moisture and it'll be good to go i also haven't washed this yet so there's that once you wash it and condition it i'm sure it'll feel much softer all right y'all that is it for me all tuesday today three different ponytails i try to give you like the top style and the bottom style which one is your favorite let me know what you think my particular favorite is a 12 inch because i've been rocking it so much and it's really grown on me and i'm actually about to take a trip to houston with one of my best friends and i'm gonna take that ponytail and live my best life <laughs> But let me know what y'all think down below. Of course, all links are listed for your convenience. And remember, when you shop through my Amazon links, honey, you are directly supporting my channel. And I cannot express how much that means to me. It seriously helps me out. So thank you to everyone who shops in my Amazon store. I put so much work into my Amazon store. And I've had my Amazon store for almost two years now. And I'm really proud of what it's become and I think it's a great resource to y'all so make sure you follow my Amazon storefront I also go live on Amazon that's a thing I've been doing for the past few months I'll be having another live at some point later this month after I come back from my travels so follow my store you can be notified also if you're into textured units in general I have an entire textured wig playlist so many videos in that playlist featuring wigs that I love that are of a either kinky curly or kinky straight texture. So make sure you check that out. And if you're new here, you can tap that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, so that you miss any of my upcoming videos. Thank you so much for joining me today for Twin All Tuesday. I hope this helped you out. Like, share with a friend, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.